Congratulations on your new violin or viola. Michael is going to help us out today and show us the parts of the instrument, how to take it out and store it, how to rosin your bow, and how to attach a shoulder rest. All things to make sure you sound great. The violin and viola are almost identical with the only difference being the size and sounds of the instrument. The body is divided into three sections. The lower bout, the waist, and the upper bout. The chin rest is located on the lower bout, along with the tailpiece and the fine tuners. Moving towards the waist, you find the bridge and the F holes. The heel attaches the neck to the upper bout. The fingerboard is on the neck, which leads to the nut, tuning pegs, and finally the scroll. Both instruments are played with the bow. The screw is located at the bottom of the bow. The frog connects both the bow hair and the bow stick. The end of the bow is called the tip. Let's start by opening the case. You'll want to have the handle on the bottom half of the case. Undo the latches and lift up. On the bottom half of the case, you'll find the instrument. Remove the instrument with your left hand, placing it on your left shoulder with your chin on the chin rest. Your left hand will be responsible for pressing the strings to change the notes. When you get an instrument from us, it'll be in tune. For the violin, standard tuning is G, D, A, E. For viola, it's C, G, D, A. The bow is vital in making sure the instruments have a good sound. The bow will be loosened to ensure it does not get damaged while being in the case. In order to tighten the bow, you'll turn the screw clockwise. You want to tighten it until the bow stick is slightly bent toward the bow hair. You don't want to over tighten it to where the stick and hair are parallel. Or where it begins to look like a bow and arrow. It's important to rosin your bow. If you have new rosin, you'll want to scratch it with either a coin or key. This will create friction and allow it to stick to the bow hair. Never touch the bow hairs with your fingers as the oils can damage them. With the correct amount of rosin, the bow should move easily over the strings while providing rich tones. An accessory we recommend for your instrument is the shoulder rest. It makes holding the instrument more comfortable, meaning you can play for longer without tiring. The shoulder rests are adjustable, so it'll fit your both full and student size instruments. If it doesn't fit, simply unscrew it and adjust to the larger or smaller notch. Then re-tighten and place it on the instrument. When you're done playing, you'll want to loosen the bow by turning the screw counterclockwise and then place it back in the case and lock it down. Wipe down the strings to get any excess rosin off of them. If you don't, they'll gunk up over time and not sound good. After that, place the instrument in the case face up, then lock down the latches. We hope you enjoy the violin and viola as much as we do. Have fun playing.